The Mitten, retold by Mrs. Vaughn's class. The Mitten, retold by Mrs. Vaughn's class. The Mitten, a Ukrainian folk tale adapted and illustrated by Mrs. Vaughn's class. Once there was a boy named Nicky who wanted wool mittens as light as snow. Baba was Nicky's grandma. At first, Baba didn't want to make the mittens. Baba finally made the snow white mittens. Baba warned Nicky that if he lost one of his mittens in, in the snow, he would never find it. Baba told Nicky that she was going to check if he was safe and sound and still had his snow white mittens. Nicky went outside to play. He was climbing a tree and left one of his mittens be behind in the snow. A moe came along. Tired from tunneling, the mo went, to, went into the mitten head first. The snowshoe rabbit came hopping by and stopped to admire his winter coat when he stopped the men. The mole wouldn't let the rabbit in, but when he saw the rabbit's big kick. The hedgehog came next after looking under wet leaves for things to eat. The rabbit and the mole didn't think there was enough room for all of them, but once they saw his prickles, they, they made room. When the owl heard all the commotion, he swooped down from the tree to see what was going on. They didn't want the owl in, but once they saw his sharp talons, they let him in. The badger came up from the snow and saw the mitten. They didn't want to let the badger in, but they then they saw his big diggers. They gave him room in the thumb of the mitten. The, the fox came next with his sharp teeth. Just the sight to the mitten made him feel drowsy. They didn't want to let the fox in, but they, then they saw his teeth. The fox in nose was <coughs> sticking out at the end of the mitten. A great bear lumbered by and spied the mitten. Not being one to be left out in the cold. The bear nosed his way into the mitten. Now who would want to argue with a bear? Baba's good mitten held fast. A meadow mouse, no bigger than an acorn, came in last. Then the bear, then the mouse went on the bear's nose. The mouse's whiskers made the bear sneeze. <coughs> when the bear sneezed, all the animals shot out of the mitten in all different directions. Nicky saw a strange white shape in the distance and he went to catch it. Nicky caught the mitten from out of the air. Nikki saw Baba looking out the window, just to make sure he was safe and sound, and still had a snow white mitten. He went back inside. Then Baba looked at the mitten, then one was stretched out and one wasn't.
Nikki was holding his black kitty. Thank you. Goodbye now. Goodbye. Goodbye. Thank you. Goodbye. Thank you. Goodbye now. Goodbye. Goodbye. Thank you. Goodbye.